Ignoring advice. Understanding the phrase for English learners. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting phrase, ignoring advice. Understanding phrases like this is crucial for mastering English. So let's dive in and find out what it truly means and how to use it in your daily conversations. Ignoring advice refers to the act of not taking into consideration or choosing not to follow suggestions, recommendations, or guidance offered by others. It's important to understand that this phrase often carries a negative connotation, implying that the advice ignored might have been valuable or beneficial. Let's look at some examples. Despite his parents' advice, he ignored it and stayed up late. Ignoring her doctor's advice, she continued to work without rest. People might ignore advice for various reasons. Sometimes it's due to stubbornness or a belief that they know better. Other times, it might be because the advice doesn't align with their personal experiences or goals. Understanding these motivations can help us comprehend the phrase's use in different contexts. Here are a few scenarios. A teenager might ignore their teacher's advice on studying, thinking they have a better method. An employee might ignore advice from colleagues, believing their own strategy is more efficient. Ignoring advice can lead to both positive and negative outcomes. Sometimes, going against advice might lead to unexpected success. However, more often, it results in missed opportunities or avoidable problems. For instance, ignoring financial advice could lead to economic troubles. On the other hand, ignoring popular opinion and following one's intuition can sometimes lead to breakthroughs. In English conversations, this phrase is often used to give opinions or share experiences. For example, I regret ignoring my friend's advice about that investment. You're ignoring my advice, but I hope it works out for you. We hope this video has helped you understand the meaning and usage of ignoring advice. Remember, advice is often given with good intentions, but the decision to follow it is always yours. Keep practicing your English and don't hesitate to ask questions or seek advice on your learning journey. See you in the next video.